So welcome back guys to Let's Play Fabley 2, episode 18. The big adultery number. Not adultery number, but adult. Number of the adult. Number of becoming a man. Age of becoming a a woman. Age of becoming responsible. Alright, so anyway. <laughs> Uh, I, I accessed uh, this little cave, this opening in between episodes, and it's actually just the Wellspring, which I'm assuming is an area just for layer quests and whatnot. But we don't have to access it right now, so I'm not going to show off that just yet. But you guys will see in future events. I'm sure of it. So what we're going to be doing uh, in this... Oh my god, that looks so cool. You can see my shadow running across and the rocks so far. Oh, I love this game. I just fucking love this game. If you guys are wondering, this is the third session of my recording... Um, episode of my recording session sorry and uh yeah i'm fucking loving it i'm just in the fable mood and i have approximately like six hours until i have to go to work so uh i don't know i might just be busting out a few episodes consistently or consecutively even can i do anything about it like it? can i is there anything over here to explore because there are stairs leading down here i mean there's gotta be something right i can go this way but it doesn't seem to lead anywhere oh wait no the stairs just lead underneath here and then go back up Alright, so we're done over here. As far as I know, we just gotta head back to uh, Oakfield and hand in our quest. We gotta talk to Barnum. And relieve him of his worry. I'm pretty sure Rook Ridge, Rook Ridge Inn is now safe. Safe place to be. There's no bandits and whatnot. Oh, wait a second. There was something I forgot to search last episode. I didn't realize that this was here. I thought this was an empty room. And there's mud brick chocolate. What the fuck? I've got pure chocolate. Why do I want mud brick chocolate? That sounds disgusting. Can I break open these barriers? No. For, for this game's time, like, fuck me, there's so many interactive options, and the overworld is just so immense that it just doesn't seem like... I just don't even know how to fucking, like, comprehend how this was made in the time it was made. I don't know. I'm pretty sure we, I'm pretty sure we searched up here previously. This isn't, yeah, there's no point in going back up here. I remembered... Where's that pallet there, though? Is that, like, part of a fallen bridge? Yep, definitely part of the fallen bridge. Okie dokie. So now that we've fucking done with all this bullshit, we will head on towards uh, Oakfield and hand in this quest. I'm not sure what's coming after this quest. Because, like I said, um, I haven't played this game in a long time. So I really don't know where the quests are heading. Like, I know what happens in the basic story. Oh, my God. This is the Temple of Darkness, isn't it? Like, up here? This is all evil and whatnot. It's really weird that it's actually over this like super majestic and almost blindingly bright bridge. But yeah, this is the uh, temple of like darkness or evil. Or, am I right? This door is locked. Okay. Is there any sort of signpost acknowledging the fact that I came up here for good reason? Nope, this place is just complete fucking away. There we go, it's got a bunch of skulls and shit. Yeah, this is definitely the temple of, like, sacrifice or whatever. But yeah, that's a cool little tidbit I thought I'd show you guys, because I saw that in the previous episode and actually just ran past it. I don't know why I didn't check it out. It's because I knew there was no quest or anything, but yeah. It's a cool thing to observe. I mean, it definitely looks like one of the most majestic locations in Fable 2. I mean, look at that fucking temple. Look at that temple. Let's just cut back around here. Is that, is that one of the signposts? Cultist skull and red. I can't even see it. It's too. It's not even blowing. All right, oak build. All right, we're back. What are you growling for, Baxter? Oh, it's because this is where we found the Hobbs last time. They wouldn't have respawned, would they? We took care of the bastards. Yeah, there's no one here. I know it's lights out. Here we go. Oh, I don't want to go to Rook Ridge. I want to just get through this little fucking shit without going it. There we go. There we go. We're in Oakfield. We're back to the beauty, beautiful landscape this place is and is known for. Where is the pub? Do we have to go like- Oh god, you look magnificently drunk, my friend. What the fuck is the pub? Is that- is that it all the way over there? Jesus Christ, this place is way bigger than I remember. No, that is a house. The pub should be down here. Yeah, I'm right. I'm right. Because there was a bridge right before the pub. The bridge of Oakfield! What is this? Some sort of like farm? Not growing farm? Baxter, why you keep on growling and shit, man? He's one aggressive fucking dog. I'll tell you that much. Alright, so let's go all the way back in the bar. I'm sorry for pushing you out of the way, bud. I am one aggressive drinker. Get out of my way, you stupid hoe. How you doing, Barnum the Great? 
Ah, the hero returns. A stupendous success. Jolly well done. Yep. Of course, turns out those deeds weren't entirely genuine. So the toll thing isn't going to work out quite as planned. Baxter, stop growling at the fucking closet, dude. At least it's not me who has to rebuild the bridge now. Mm hmm. Okay, so I might be broke, <laughs> but I'll bounce back. Always do. That's the spirit, Barnum. Anyway, here's my trusty Thesaurus, as promised. Thesaurus? You never know when Thesaurus. you'll be caught in a lexicological quandary. Lexicological? What the fuck is what? Where is it then? Give me the Thesaurus. Alright, dash of goggles as well. Barnum's Thesaurus. We got 250 renown points. Rookridge can now be rebuilt. Oh, okay. That is cool. Oh, so we couldn't actually... Oh, that makes sense. That was the whole reason for the bridge being broken and those do those uh, dudes on the other side, those bandits, making fun of us because if we jump into the water and go through Hob Cave, then we couldn't actually get back to Bowerstone until the bridge is, the bridge is rebuilt. But the bridge can now be rebuilt because we, uh, we took out Dash. So that's good. That's good. I never actually realized the importance of that quest, but yeah, I guess. Thanks to you. Oh, to look at that. I'm holding up his goggles. Ale to the yale. I'm not sure what uh, it would look like if I placed Dash's goggles You've done it. on Almost my face. Everyone in Oakfield has heard of you. Oh, that is sweet. I just showed up here as well, like two episodes ago. Now you can go back to the abbot. Okay. What? Where? Oh, the temple? Oh, because I proved myself. I forgot. I forgot that was the whole point I was doing this. So the fuck am I going this way? This way, right? Did I even check what was in this place in the end? I'm not sure if I did. Whoa. This place looks neato. Oh, I did, I did, I did. I just don't, didn't recognize it from this side. I didn't realize there was so much hay here. Wait, you just barked, Baxter. Okay, so I'm running back through this hay stacked place and fucking bullshit scenery. Yeah, it looks cool and whatnot, but oh my god, I just want to get to the Abbot. And I wasted so much time just running through... Unnecessary, is that Ross? Yeah, Ross, I don't give a fuck about your feelings. Although he is starting to become... Uh, likely to become one of my future allies. He seems to have risen in the friendship level. So we're not going to waste all that time searching for that bullshit grass or any of this crap. We're just going to run straight to the abbot. Because I want to know if I have truly proved myself. Because, I mean, I I messed around and wasted a lot of time in those previous episodes. <laughs> I'm not going to lie. Did it happen. Baxter, you have got a pace, my boy! That is what you call a dog sprint. Dog sprint and a half. Oh, who are you? I don't care. Have a gift? <laughs> Shove it up your ass. I wonder what the abbot is going to say. And I actually have the time to listen to his text this time, his dialogue. It's you. I prayed for your return. Alright. I heard what you did in Rookridge. I think you could be of great use to us. Oh, yeah? Baxter, stop being so fucking vile. Come, walk with me a while. Oh, I'm not going to walk with you. I'm not walking anywhere. I just remembered. Basically... Go to the sacred cave and escort the monk to the wellspring of life. Escort the oh! The cave is not far. Fair enough. The wellspring of light. That is that. You probably passed it on your way here. That's probably. Strongest monk will be waiting for you when you're ready. Okay, so the the strongest monk that Abbot is referring to is the other hero, the first of the other heroes that we meet. Our first hero awaits us. All right, Teresa, just fucking pointing that out for me. So uh, yeah, we're meeting Even the monk. Teresa, I swear to motherfuck, I'm gonna shit. On your corpse if you don't shut those lips. Alright, so yeah, to, <laughs> to just point out, we're going to meet the first hero. Uh, assumingly where we thought that uh, a Bridge Too Far location was, but it's not a Bridge Too Far. That was the name of the quest, and it was telling me that if I entered the Wellspring Cave, that I would lose all my quest progress, which made sense, but I didn't know what the fuck was going on at the time. So now, I guess, yeah, we're going to head back through the dashingly beautiful Oakville. Uh, uh, Oakfield, shit! Every time! Why do they have to have Oak Vale and Oak Field in two family kids? <laughs> Who's singing? Who's singing? Who is fucking singing? I have got to find out. You're up here, aren't you? In the unnecessary location. I bet. Right? I can hear some, like, beautiful voice. Like, no doubt, this shit sounds so... Melodic, and it's just like, what is that? Is that body? Someone died here. Well, this isn't where the voice is coming from. 
Voice is coming from up here. Wait a second. I just realized who the fuck is singing. I had no idea it was Hannah that was singing. That is so fucking cool. Oh my god. Alright, I'm going to outro it right here. Thank you guys so much for watching. Oh, that was such a cool little si tidbit. White Balverines. Oh my fucking god. That is so nostalgic. It's unreal. Okay, so thank you guys for watching. Oh my god. Be sure to leave a like. Oh, I can't even like. i got to take my headphone out. Be sure to leave a like down below, uh, your support is highly appreciated as always, I can't listen to her sing without just tearing up. And subscribe for more of the series, and I will see you guys when we formally introduce ourselves to the monk, the strongest monk ever apparently, and the first hero, Sister Hannah. So yeah, I'll see you guys in episode 19. Down by the reed.